Well, all city owned golf courses will finally be opening to the public on 4th of July. This is a week after the city approved $700,000 to make improvements. WTOL's Emma Henderson spoke with the head of the Parks Department, who says it's still a work in progress. That's right, Dan. We met at Detweiler Park, where they're still working to get things ready. Extra rain, a change in management, and now extremely hot temperatures are proving to be a challenge. If you were here last season and you're coming back, you might say, oh, actually things are looking better. Um, if you were here years ago and you remember this as the fabulous course that it will be once again, um, you may not be as pleased. Karen Ranny Wilkins, Commissioner of Parks, Recreation and Forestry, wants people to manage their expectations before heading out to the city run golf courses. They just recently went under new management and got an influx of cash. Detweiler and Collins have got some of the same challenges uh, moving forward, but I think that people can and should expect to have a good experience, but given the transition that we've had to go through, uh, we're asking for a little bit of uh, understanding. Over the past couple of weeks, regular golfers like Ian McCarthy have been seeing big improvements at the Ottawa Park Golf Course, which has been open for about a month. I would say over the past couple of weeks, it's gotten much better in terms of uh, water logging. He plays once a week here in a league, and although it's later into the season, he believes there's still plenty of time. I mean, at least our golf league goes to September, so you got at least two months, maybe three months to get some golf in. So get out there and uh, swing away. And while she expects things to be a little difficult in the beginning, Randy Wilkins believes the new funding and fixes will continue to help the current condition of city run courses. Yeah, the experience is going to be one that will get progressively better as the season goes on. Now you'll be able to play nine of the 18 holes at Detweiler, which will run you $15 a game, including a cart and 10 without. Reporting live in studio tonight, Emma Henderson for WTOL 11.